Where are we going? We're picking flowers for Radharani because today is Radhashtami. Very special place then. Did you know that Mayapur would not exist if um, Radharani would not have made it? Let's come, it's getting such a rain. We have to pick some flowers. With this stick, I picked flowers for Radha Rani. What did you do here? What did you do here? What? You made it, or? Did you made it? How? With a long stick. Okay, that you can reach high. And what is... And here, what did you do? You made a small stick. Then this small stick that there, you can do in two ways from here and from down here ah okay Four, and then you can two okay oh, i see i didn't know that where did you learn this guruku ah. i was doing so that every day when i came when i just came to guruku i was doing this every day mm -hmm. that's clever because once i wanted to pick a flower and i didn't reach too high And then some people in the, uh, on the some people wrote to me, yeah, there is a special instrument you can pluck flowers. They use it here in Bengal. I didn't know. But I have a family member who knows all this stuff. Because these, because the other ones are with like strong. Yes. You can like, you know, just boom, you can just rip off cap petals instead of the whole flower. Oh. But Champaka, the thing is very weak. Yeah. So it's easier. Ah, I see, I see. Okay, let's try it out, if it works. Show me, show me. Oh, Champa. Today is Rodastami, and um, like I said before, Mayapur would not exist without Radharani. And why? Because one day it was like that that Krishna was um, in the forest of Rindavan with another gopi, and Radharani heard about it. And then she thought, oh, what can I do to attract Krishna so that he's coming with me again? So she um, went to a place and created a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful um, forest. She created a place where um, many creepers are there, or nice meadows are there where the birds and the bugs and the deers live very peacefully, where a lot of flowers are growing, like Malika flowers, um, Matila flowers, and much, 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 much more flowers. And um, today we had a little service to collect some flowers for Radharani, but um, we became quickly help from, 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 from other kids and um, but Goranga told us that in the morning already a lot of devotees went here to do the same service, to picking flowers for 
Srimati Radharani. And if you also want to do some service for Srimati Radharani, there are a lot of opportunities. You can, for example, make a, um, a beautiful home festival for Srimati Radharani. You can cook for her, you can um, bathe her, you can make beautiful garlands for her and um, sing for her. She laughs when the Harinam Sankita movement goes on and more and more and more and more people come to her beloved Krishna. Happy Radastami! Thank you, Ranga, for your help. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, devotees, dear devotees. Thank you, Maya Purdang. Ah, today is, today is, Radas to me. Yes, the special day for Srimati Radharaj. Radharani is so beautiful and likable and lovable by Mother Yasoda. She's always thinking, how can I have her as my daughter-in-law? So she was very young and little. So Mother uh, Yasoda bring, uh, invites her and starts putting turmeric in her hand, yeah. right? And then she doesn't know what's all this about. And then uh, it's time for her to go home and along the way she's going with the turmeric in her hand. So she washes her hands in the lake before she reaches home. And obviously, as you know, Krishna is always missing her, looking for her. He comes by and he says, what is in this lake? It's all yellow. I wonder what's in it. And he jumps in and guess what? He comes out as Lord Chaitanya. So that's Krishna uh, in the spiritual world as Lord Chaitanya. Radharani did not open her eyes till Krishna touched her hand. Then she opened her eyes. The first thing she saw was Krishna. Her eyes are always blue. The inside of the part of the eyes are blue because she likes to see Krishna. What do you know about Krishna, Radharani? She is um, born in a golden lotus. 
Oh, was it golden? Yeah. Yeah, yeah she was born in the golden lotus. Then and the Brisa father, then the father found, uh, her. found her there when he was meditating. Found her and then brought her to to Goku. To no. Not to Goku, to Vashana. Oh yeah, to Vashana.